Speaking of also very interesting, oh, Carlos signs. My man Carlos, oh my gosh. I love how he's no longer driving for Ferrari and he's driving for a team Carlos needs a seat next year. I'm yes. all for it. I'm all for not following team orders and just driving the heck out of that Ferrari. Oh my gosh. He had such a good race. He overtook Leclerc twice. Uh, yeah. It was awesome. I'm I'm so happy. I feel like it's not going to be great for the team this year, but I don't care because Carlos needs to show that he's an amazing driver. Everyone knows it, but um, I really hope he beats Charles Leclerc in Drivers Championship this year, just to kind of stick it yeah. to Ferrari before he leaves. Yeah, I I I think a the 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 ferrari versus ferrari was some of the most exciting racing that we saw today especially in the first half of the race because that that you know second third of the race was was very much you know very processional which is is what it is um but i think that not only did carlos drive one hell of a race i think he outdrive outdrove the car um cuz i think that you know, yes, the Ferrari is phenomenal on one lap, but based on, you know, obviously, you know, one race's performance is not indicative of all, you know, of all the good and all the bad, but I am a little concerned with Ferrari based on their performance and also based on the setup issues that Leclerc had today, because, you know, he, he was the, like the most despondent P4 finisher I've ever seen. Yeah. No, I agree. I think it was, they kept mentioning the wind and how the wind was changing. So I feel like this race in general for every car, that was a factor. So it's yeah. not necessarily, we can take results of this weekend going into the rest of the season. Um, this is also a really difficult track because of all the sand and the, on the track and everything. So I think it is, you know, that's harder on the tires, tire management, things like that. It's also unseasonably cold. I think right now they were saying, yes. Unless so, you're Ted Kravitz and you always wear shorts. <laughs> God love him. That was that was something um, that they made a, a very, like, they made a point to make a point of that. 